Hello everyone and welcome back. Uh, today's video is about what's in my handbag. In the last video I mentioned my new kind of straw bag and I told you that I would make what's in my handbag and here it is. Now the straw bag having its moment as you know as of actually from last year the wave started last year and I feel like this year it's still very it's going very strong but I feel like people are getting tired of all the straw bags already so I got more or less straw bag inspired bag but it's not exactly straw bag what I find about straw bags is that they can be tricky, they can tag on your clothes, they can actually spoil it. So I decided to stay away from the actual straw bag and get something like this. It very much reminds you of that kind of vibe, but it wouldn't be straw bag. So it's made of bamboo, it, it has the wooden handles and but as of this you know straw bags or like a, like row bags it has inside the cotton little bag so you cannot see the content of your purse now let's see what's in my bag and how much you could fit in this quite small and yet compact bag now this bag is by the brand Uterke uh, this brand belongs to Zara and uh, but it's like a high quality brand sort of uh, yeah and the price is obviously are much higher than Zara and you don't find like a lot of things there for instance you had probably four or five purses like this in the shop or even less basically i didn't get this purse in the shop as i had to order it because they were sold out within one week in every shop in barcelona in every utarki shop in barcelona so yeah that was the really the eat bag of the season now let's check what in the purse as you can see it's like a basket sort of a um, purse it's very handy you can open it very easily and you have this kind of a pouch here it's not very big but since well because it's like a very flexible uh, you can just you know drop things here and be fine because it's not a structural bag I don't like structural bags. I need something that I can just throw things. Because I'm carrying with me a bottle of water every day, all the time. Now it's almost empty because I just got home. I'm always carrying with me a book. I know. I mean, it occupies a lot of space, but I never leave home without a book. Now, at the moment, I'm having Anthony Trollope book. It's one of those uh, if you know, if you read Anthony Trollope, you know his Palliser series, so uh, yeah, I'm reading the second one and I'm enjoying it very much. Okay, this is not exactly the book review, so why I'm carrying with me the book all the time? Because I kind of have this thing, I always read a book whenever I have a spare moment and when I sit down to have a coffee, have a little break, I grab a book instead of the phone. This is my thing. Now a book, so yeah, that's it, like a big thing. Now a wallet, of course, and I have a very big wallet because I carry everything in here. I don't have a separate, like a, for the cards or business cards, um, like separate little bag, little purse, how you call it. I have everything in my wallet so why I like it it's by Cottonelli it's really really pretty I like that it's very 
just you know beige color and goes with everything with every purse now because of the space for all the cards here and also because it has well i emptied it so nothing falls out it has three space for the coins the bigger two big on the side and the small one here so basically what i put the one and two coins in one space in the middle one the smaller one the all the dark ones five two one and the 20s and 50s and 10s here for me it's very important because i don't like to have a mass of all i need to separate them and the two compartments for the money also i separate the big ones and the small ones this is what i like about this wallet and it's it's very nice it's like a, it also can serve as a purse a little bit kind of a clutch now i have my notepad of course i'm a writer i, li I write a lot i do know i make notes all the time and yeah just little things makeup that i want to check in the shop this is actually by Givenchy Irresistible. I think I got it with the. I don't remember. Anyhow, love again because it's original. My pen that I love. This is by Swarovski Limited Edition. Look at this prettiness. It's all roses here. And of course, this sparkle. As you know. What else? The phone, of course. And the rest, okay, the snack. I always carry with me the snack because I don't have always the time to stop and eat. And if I find myself completely out of time and still way to go to have some food, I will always have this raw energy bar. This one is Morocco and coconut. I actually have it in all my purses just so I always take it and I know there's a snack there. So yeah, I'm carrying it with me all the time. I always have little candies with me. This is one of my favorites. This is Lecaro. I think it's a Swedish brand and it's raspberry, raspberry lemongrass. What I like about these candies, they're like a chewy ones. It's, they have no sugar and they have stevia instead of sugar. It's a natural sweetener. It's not your like sweetener that you put instead of sugar. It's like, it's better. It's, uh, it's natural, it's from the plant. So yeah having this with me okay the only thing that i don't really find space for is the makeup bag i don't have exactly the tiny 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 makeup bag probably i have one by longchamp but yeah i just put the i just like you know drop it here the essential like really essentials the powder Mikado Shifa powder, everybody knows. The clinic chubby stick, which can be used also as a lipstick and as a touch up um, blush. The balm, Clarence, always here. And hand cream. That's that. Yes. And you can all fit in this purse, which is great. It's it's not heavy like now it's empty and it's not very heavy and yet it has this you know sort of a heavy quality to it you know how to put it like I don't like very light purses unless it's long sham that's another story I like that it has a little bit of a, you know texture to it sort of and yeah and this is just amazing I'm loving it it's good as for the city as to go to the to the beach or to the maybe not to the beach because you cannot really put a lot of things here but you know for the walk on the beach or when you are just you know having a lunch by the sea it just still looks very relevant and you know very much summary so yeah this is it for today I hope you enjoyed the video. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. If you like this um, video, please give me a thumb up. And I see you next week. Bye-bye.